My name is Walter Scott. I am a high school carpentry teacher with Local 909. Area that I teach in is Local 951. So the tip of the trade I have for you is how you tell someone's birth date using a tape measure. What you want to do is take the tape and you're going to find, want to find 121. So it's 2021. So how old are you? 50. So you're going to go up on the tape and find 50. So if you look across from 50, you were born in 1971. The other one that we teach, that you teach kids, so, and it becomes where it's a mental block. So if you're thinking and you're trying to divide something in two, so we'll use um, six foot for an example. So you take and go put the end of the tape at the six foot mark where the tape is bent see if I can, where the tape is bent. If you were to fold that in half and break the tape, it's at three foot. So you just divided six feet in half. And you can do that with, with fractions. So you can go, if you wanted, say 64 and a half, it's the same thing. Half of that is 32 and a quarter. The other thing I teach the kids is you can add and subtract with it. So if you had 64 inches and you needed to add another six, you put the six inches at the 64 mark and read the end of the tape. So 64 plus six is 70 inches. So you can add and subtract with it. You can divide with it. There's, there's lots of other things that you can do with a tape measure. That's just a few that I teach the kids on. It gives them a chance when they're, they're struggling because we only have 50 minutes in a day. So they want to get stuff done. So when they start going, try to go too fast and they, they can't think, is when I say, okay, just take your tape measure and use the tape measure. It'll give you the answer. It gives you time to rest your brain for half a second to where you can go on. If you do it right, it'll give you the right number every time.